Welcome to this short teaser video on Kaplena. My name is Maurice, I'm a co-founder of Kaplena, and in the next couple of minutes, I'm gonna briefly showcase how to use the platform to get insights from your reviews, surveys, or any other kind of customer or employee feedback that you might have. Specifically, we wanna get the topics that appear in the data, quantify these topics, and differentiate the sentiment on a topic level. And finally, we want to visualize these results, create advanced analyses and share them in an interactive dashboard. So let's get started. The first step is getting your data into Kaplena. For this purpose, you can either upload a file or you can use any of the provided integrations that we have ready at hand. So you may scrape reviews from any one of these sites or connect one of your existing accounts, for example, Qualtrics. Finally, you could of course also use our REST API to ingest data from your internal systems automatically. For the purpose of this demo, I have uploaded a data set about TVs with roughly a thousand rows. The first step is now to define the topics that I actually want to quantify in my data. And for this purpose, we have created an interactive workflow where you work together with the AI to determine the topics that are relevant for you. So yes, I do want to start from scratch and yes, my project contains sentiments. Now the AI will start looking through the data through these thousand rows and try to define topics that might be relevant for me. The data looks roughly like this. So those are various feedbacks about the TVs I mentioned. Now the AI has come up with a suggestion here, a first suggestion here on the left-hand side, a number of categories, for example, quality, with specific topics, for example, quality of products within them. My job is now to look through these categories and remove the ones that I deem irrelevant. So for example, I might deselect the no problems one because it doesn't make sense to me. And I might deselect the benefits one because I don't like it either. And the AI will then automatically redistribute the topics that were within these categories to the most appropriate remaining bucket. In the next step, the AI will try to identify potentially similar topics and then suggest you to look over them. For example, um, here it has suggested that I look over the topics familiarity with brand, Samsung experience and experience with Samsung as they might be somehow related and not well distinguishable. And my job as a user is now to uh, make a judgment call here and potentially remove some of them or rename them accordingly. In the final step, I can now add my own topics or let the AI generate further ones even within specific buckets. This whole process would probably take roughly five to 10 minutes, depending on the complexity of my project. Once I'm done, I hit save and the AI will start running over these thousand rows and start categorizing every one of them into the identified topics. This has now already happened. It usually takes only a couple of seconds and I'm instantly presented with the first results. So I can see the distribution here between the different categories and even see what the distribution is within the categories of negative, neutral and positive mentions. I can also dig into a category and look at the specific topics within them. I now have multiple options. Either I can start creating visualizations and dashboards and analyses directly or, and this is really one of the amazing USPs of this application, you can go into the data and fine tune the AI. You can nudge this massive large language model into the direction you wanted by simply reviewing a couple of rows in the UI. And I'm gonna briefly show you how this looks like. So here we're now in the topic assignment view and I could go through a couple of these rows and either confirm the topic assignment of the AI or adjust the topics to my liking by adding further topics or removing any one of the existing and, and previously assigned ones. 
What then happens is that the AI will periodically update its predictions, learning from these reviews that I have made and apply these learnings to the rest of the data. That whole process is fully interactive, only takes a couple of minutes and going through a couple of rows here, maybe 20, 50 or 100 rows, I can within very, a very short time frame get to a quality which is really comparable to a human level analysis. So a huge customization potential with very little human effort gives you a very high degree of quality in the end. Once I'm done with this process, I can switch into the visualizations module. And here I have a number of options to plot the data in any format I want to also include further variables that I have in my data. We can start off with a simple bar chart illustrating the sentiment distribution as we saw it already, uh, but you could also do the same in a tree map where you get a high level overview of the distribution of topics or we could do more advanced analyses like a relationship diagram, for example, plotting the correlation between different topics. There are a number of other choices I'm not going to go into right now, but you can then combine these different chart and analysis types into a dashboard, which is the final deliverable and final output of the application. Parentheses, of course, you can also download. Here uh, in such a dashboard, you will tell your story. So you can combine these charts in the way you want them to be seen and then share them with your stakeholders, whoever they might be, if they are your team, if you're in a corporate position or if they're your clients, if you're more in a market research position. The cool thing is that all these charts and dashboards remain fully interactive. So I could, for example, apply a filter now depending on my data, or I can click into any specific segment to view the data, which is really behind this, which helps me understand the categorization and what the user actually wanted to convey. So this was Kaplena in a nutshell. If you're interested in finding out more about the platform, we'd be very happy to jump into a personalized demo with you anytime. Have a great day.